हेलो एंड वेलकम यू ऑल माय हार्ड वर्किंग एंड ग्रेट स्टूडेंट्स जय मेन 2019 थाउजेंड नाइनटीन इज नाउ ओवर एंड दिस इज अ टाइम फॉर अस टू स्टार्ट वर्किंग फॉर जय एडवांस आई हैव ऑलरेडी सोल्ड ऑल द क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम जय एडवांस 2018 थाउजेंड एटीन द लिंक टू विच इज गिवन इन द आई आईकन Let us now go to our questions from J Advance 2017 Physics Paper One. Our first question is: A block M hangs vertically at the bottom end of a uniform rope of constant mass per unit length. The top end of the rope is fixed to rigid support at O. A transverse wave pulse one. of wavelength lambda 0 is produced at point o on the rope the pulse takes time t o a to reach point a if the wave pulse of wavelength lambda 0 is produced at point a pulse 2 without disturbing the position of m it takes time t a o to reach point O, which of the options is or are correct? Our options are the time T A O equals T O A. The velocities of the two pulses, pulse one and pulse two, are same at midpoint of the rope. The wavelength of the pulse one becomes longer when it reaches point. a and the velocity of any pulse along the rope is independent of its frequency and wavelength friends this is an interesting problem from mechanical waves and may have one or more than one choice correct before going further please press the subscribe button and don't forget to press the bell icon to receive the notification of all my future videos Let us now solve this question. We know that the speed of transverse pulse in a stretched rope is given by c equals square root of t divided by mu, where t is the tension in the rope and mu is the mass per unit length of the rope. It is clear that the speed of the wave. is independent of the frequency and wavelength of the pulse and hence option d is correct irrespective of whether the pulse is going up or going down the tension in the rope at any point is the same and hence at any point the speed of two pulses are the same and hence the time T O A equals time T A O, and hence options A and B are correct. Furthermore, as we go from point A to O, due to the weight of the rope, the tension in the rope increases, and hence the speed of the pulse at point O is higher than that at point A. moreover we know lambda equals speed of the wave divided by the frequency that clearly means higher the speed the higher the wavelength so wavelength increases as we go from point a to point o therefore option c is false to summarize options a b and d are correct whereas option c is false friends this is a very very simple problem from sound and waves and is based on speed of transverse waves in a stretched string and could have been done verbally i hope you could understand the problem very well if you still have difficulties please write to me in the comment box and i will reply back don't forget to comment like and share this video with your friends 
and do visit us again for our next video till then jai hind